Rob Lapolis alongside head coach Justin Quenville prior to this Thursday night game here inside the American Bank Center against the Odessa Jackalopes. And coach, thanks for taking time to talk with us here before this big game. Thanks for having me. Well, just talk about the Odessa Jackalopes. The last time you saw them was the home opener here in Corpus Christi next weekend in Odessa. Haven't seen them since then. How have they changed? You know, a lot different um, in terms of everything from systems to players to, uh, you know, just overall execution. You know, they've got some confidence here. Uh, they've got a great coaching staff and an unbelievable culture that they've created there over the years in terms of, you know, the Jackalopes Nation. And it's one of those things where, uh, you know, we, we got to go into this game with the mindset that, you know, not only is this a playoff game for us, but it's a, it's a big implication. And it's also a little, little, uh, little uh, bittersweet uh, revenge on our part. You know, we felt like we didn't execute the way we wanted to, uh, yeah, you know, even though it was a while ago last time we played them in, in Odessa. But it's something that we, 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 we haven't forgotten, you know, and we're looking forward to beating them. And, you know, they, they've changed their structure a little bit in terms of their defensive zone coverage and some of their, you know, uh, their key components in the L Ozone. But, I mean, we're, we're lucky. We're, we're, we're fortunate here that we, we've got a lot of video and we, you know, work hard and we study hard and we prepare ourselves with the mindset that this is, uh, you know, the biggest game of the year. Coach, two great teams with two great goaltenders. Yeah, I think, uh, you know, if you're a Corpus Christi Ice Race fan and you like goals, this might not be the game for you. I mean, hopefully we score more than they do, and that's the whole point of this. But, you know, at the end of the day, these are two goaltenders that have really, really stood on their heads this year and really given both clubs uh, a great opportunity to win every night. And, and you know, um, you know, for, for our club, we can't ask anything more um, from Anthony Stollers and, you know, what a bright spot he's been. And obviously the attention, you know, that he's drawn for himself has been very, very deserving. And, you know, uh, on the other end of it, uh, you know, uh, Bucky's been great for them. And, you know, obviously he's another big body, very similar to Anthony. A um, little different, uh, you know, technique, but more or less just, you know, gets the job done every night. And, they, you know, teams pepper him with shots, but we got to find a way to get bodies. You know, we've, we've worked on a few things that, you know, hopefully we can counteract with that we can uh, create some more opportunities with but uh, yeah definitely something that you know we're looking forward to beating them with coach go back to last weekend what a weekend for the ice rays it started on thursday night with a win against the texas tornado not a great game on friday but saturday what a game one of the most ex more exciting games of the year in my opinion yeah well uh you know i'm definitely proud of the guys for how they bounce back you know that's definitely always a tough blow you know when when, when you're kind of you know, put in a situation where your backs are against the wall and, you know, you start playing on your heels a little bit. And I felt like we did that on Friday night when Odessa took it to us, you know. I mean, uh, Amarillo took it to us. And, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, you could take it two ways. You know, we had a great game on, on Thursday against uh, Texas where we were flying on all cylinders and things were clicking our way. And, you know, we definitely, you know, uh, put them in their place. But to go back the next night and, you know, not follow through with a continued effort was very disappointing on our end. So uh, consistency has been our biggest thing of late this past month. Uh, I'm glad that we were able to close out the weekend with, you know, two of three against the two top teams in our division. And, you know, we can't ask for more in that, in that regards. But definitely would like to put forth another good effort here on a consistent basis this weekend. All right. That's head coach Justin Quenville. I'm Rob Lapolis. The Ice Rays in action tonight, 7.05 p.m. here inside the American Bank Center.